Hello there, Internet, and hello to you, Adam Harding. And you say you want to use BM3 so bad, Beatmaker 3 that is, but it doesn't support MIDI CC. Well, Adam, I'm about to make you a very happy man. I want you to check carefully what happens when I tweak this knob. Well, I'll tell you exactly how I did this. This is kind of a workaround. You can assign MIDI CCs to macro controllers. That's right, you've got 16 macro controllers inside Beatmaker 3 and all of them can be assigned with a MIDI CC number. We open up the menu and make sure that we are in the settings page then press MIDI and here we have all of the assigned MIDI that you can have and all I had to do was to make sure that Beatmaker 3 was connecting to my Nano Key Studio right here. So let's say we want to assign this knob to Macro Control 1 then just tap right there and tweak and now it says CC27. So after you've assigned your knobs on your MIDI controller to all of the macro controls, just head out of the menu and then start choosing stuff you want to assign to the macro controls. So we're going to double tap on the gain control here tap that and we get a list of all available macro controls. Now just tap a macro control in our case number two. Now we should be able to control the gain knob through the macro control with MIDI CC. So when I tweak this now and look at that since these are macro controls we can now assign more parameters so double tap on that go to macro controls and send that to macro 2 and now we are controlling the gain knob and the cutoff at the same time as usual i wish you a very productive week now go finger all of your stuff and have a lot of fun doing it and adam i know you're gonna have fun yeah